SDB the board game is an asymmetrical roll and move team game that emphasizes negotiation. You play on one of three teams, the SCP team, the Chaos Insurgency team, or the Nine-Tailed Fox team. Each team has their own unique objectives and abilities. It is quite difficult for one team to achieve their goal on their own, so teams must negotiate with each other in order to achieve their goals. Players explore a maze-like facility as the map is separated into 20 different rooms. Players can only see one room at a time. When they switch rooms, they put the old room back in the board stack. Players must try to remember the facility as they navigate it. The players must try to find each other to battle or rescue the other players. If you're on the SCP team, you can play as six different SCPs that all have unique and overpowered abilities, such as the statue, the plague doctor, the shy guy, the possessive mask, the old man, and the old AI. SCP The Board Game is a 3-8 to eight player game that takes about an hour to play. Buy it at the crowd sale for a potential discount as a stretch goal. SCP The Board Game has an expansion, the Weapons and Armor Expansions. Now included in the game is three different types of cards, weapon cards, armor cards, and item cards. At the start of the game, the items are put into a numbered folder. When a player is in a room, they can search that room for items. All players have a hand limit of three, including their key cards. Players must carefully choose what items to discard, leave behind, or pick up into their hand. Any respawning player gets to take one item from the discard. Most items can be upgraded with SCP-914. Four new SCPs were added as playable SCPs, which include 3D Specs, With Many Voices, The Many-Winged Angel, and Predatory Darkness. SCP The Board Game Weapons and Armor Expansion is available with SCP The Board Game in the crowd sale. The more copies sold, the greater the discount. The crowd sale goes live on May 10th, 2023. Make sure to hit remind me on the crowd sale so you get notified when it goes live.